Hey guys, this is Comic You Know and Comic Frontline, and today I'm doing a topic video on what's next for the X-Men films. So the person recommended this was Instinct RT, and their channel uh, link will be in the description below. And guys, if you have any future recommendations for topic videos, please let me know in the comments below. And if I answer them, that means in a couple of weeks, they'll either be on Comic Uno or Comic Frontline, because I double dose my topic videos. Now, usually for Comic Frontline, I have them every Sunday or Monday, and for Comic Uno, I have them every Friday with my comic book reviews. Uh, running a little low on topic videos, so it would be great if you can recommend a way. So uh, talking about this topic, which is what's next for the X-Men films. And uh, so, of course, we have the Logan film coming up and then New Mutants, which we know a little bit about. And then uh, Gambit. Will it happen? We don't know. Of course, the next Deadpool movie, which also has some hiccups with creators leaving and things like that. And then the rumor of Brian Singer leaving for the next X-Men movies and then rebooting the movies. That was the latest rumor. Of course, that has not been confirmed. So, I mean, the, the best you could say of, you know, trying to talk about the X-Men franchise, the, at least the movie fran uh, franchise, is... X-Men Apocalypse not doing very well. I think box office wise it did okay, uh, but the critics didn't love it. And I watched it, I liked it more than other people, I didn't think it was like the best X-Men movie, but I liked it for what it was. Um, you can check out my review for that on my channel. Um, I actually enjoyed it, but I definitely want the X-Men to have more of an X-Men feel to it. I know a lot of people loved First Class because it had more of that political drive, which is so much a part of X-Men, and maybe they should continue to do that. Uh, I, of course, would love to see more of the school, uh, more of the team aspect. I think that's been really missing, is that all the characters have characterization. A lot of times, it's just Mystique, or it's Professor X. They're doing stuff, and they have these kind of two-dimensional characters behind you. So, uh, in the future, if we're, you know, whatever we're getting for these X-Men movies, that's what I would like to see is just a team and, I guess, the family of the X-Men grow in general. I would actually like to see Kitty Pride portrayed well on screen, so I haven't gotten to see that. Logan I'm excited for, uh, you know, just bringing in more female uh, characters like X-23 I think is important because the X-Men have such powerful females in their roster that Marvel can't use, so it would be nice if the X-Men movies do use them. I think X-23 is a perfect character. Still don't know how to feel for her being younger. I kind of wish she was like a teenager, uh, just because that's kind of how we were introduced to her in, in the comics. Uh, and of course, the TV show that created her character, which was X-Men Evolution. But I'm curious to see what the movie will do. Uh, New Mutants I'm really excited about because I feel like that's a franchise obviously comic book fans know about, but not really outsiders. So it'd be kind of nice to see what the mainstream audience thinks about this team. Gambit, I never needed a Gambit movie, but I think, I don't even know if that's going to happen from what it looks like with these delays and all that. I don't even know if it's been cancelled officially. I don't know. Just mentioning it. And then Deadpool was great. You know, that was a hit. And I would hope that the second movie is as good as the first. Introducing other characters like Cable will be important uh, in at least expanding the modern X-Men, because obviously that's something we don't really have, because the X-Men has been focusing on different decades, which has been really fun, and again, something that we saw from first class. But yeah, either way, you know, I'm, I'm hoping for the best with the X-Men films, and looking forward to Logan, because that's the the one we have coming up the, the soonest, really soon, actually. But hopefully you guys enjoyed. Let me know in the comments below what you think of the X-Men franchise, or at least where it's going. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. Uh, don't forget to follow me on Twitter. Don't forget to like my Facebook page. Also in the description below, there are links for my comic book, Like Father, Like Daughter. And don't forget to like the Facebook page of Like Father, Like Daughter. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.